Howdy guys, in today's video we're going to be looking at changing the width and spacing of your text within TrueCut RD Works. But before that, let's have a quick intro first. So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.co.za. We make short and easy to watch problem solving videos and we also have daily updates. Otherwise, back in the program here. Now, just a quick reminder, this is a mini series on the text tool, and I will also leave relevant links in the description so you guys can actually follow along. Now, when it comes to the width and spacing, we've got one option for the width and two options for spacing. So if I had to open here, you can see here on the top right, we've got width in percentage, then we've got character spacing and line spacing. Now, the width will actually widen the um the visual letters so if i had to make a quick duplicate of this and just show you an example so i'm going to make it just a w put this one there copy and paste another one just kind of align it now i'm just going to go a bit more extreme with the top one let's make the spacing like 120 and say okay and then as you can see the actual letter gets widened so it doesn't widen um, any spacing or so for this actual letters so if you feel like your words are too cramped on each other you can always increase the spacing and then let's maybe make this something like 80 say okay and then you'll see it feels a bit more natural now then um next up on our option on our list should i say we've got the actual um what do you call it character spacing and this will be the space in between characters once again, if you feel like they're too close on each other, you can always add a space here. Maybe make it about 10 more. And then you can see there we've got quite a space. This will be obviously way more than what I would want to do. So let's put that back. Let's maybe make it something like 2 more. Just so you can actually see the spacing. I wouldn't easily do that in a design, but uh, yeah, just for the sake of this tutorial. And then last up here, we've got line spacing. Now what this will do is it will adjust the space between your um, lines. So let's say we want to bring this a bit closer. We go about minus two. Okay, so I see we cannot go into a negative. It is good to know. I did not know that normally you can. So let's try increase this, make this one more. And then uh, let me see, I did not see any changes. So I'm going to go a bit more extreme. 10 more okay there we go so we've got a little bit of spacing there so this one is not as sensitive uh, it would seem as the other one but yeah so this will space the two um lines and then we've got the actual uh, spacing of characters as well so just a quick recap so we've got the first one here width which will um, change the width of the actual letter then we've got character spacing which is the space between all your individual characters obviously if you use a space on your keyboard it will uh, add a space between those as well and then we've got the actual line space which is the space between individual lines so if we've got multiple lines we can increase it with the setting but yeah otherwise that is it on um, the width and spacing in this video if we had to head to the website softwaretraining.co.za you guys will notice we've got a variety of different softwares to do cover and you can also isolate your search on the top right if you do not however find the training videos you're looking for just simply go here request the training video fill in the mini form then we'll do our best to try and make that for you but otherwise thanks guys for watching and cheers